Hello everyone, welcome to Python tutorial. In this tutorial, I'm going to talk about creating a new project in PyCharm. So in previous tutorial, I have already covered how to install PyCharm, do a bit of configuration. Now, this tutorial will talk about to create your first PyCharm project or Python project. So creating a project is pretty simple. Just click on um, create a new project and you will see a new project window comes up with the location where you want to create the project. Uh, there are a couple of options for uh, project interpreter. So if you um, select the project interpreter, you will see new virtual environment or you can use the existing interpreter. Now I'll cover a bit of uh, details around what uh, project interpreter, virtual environment and existing interpreter means. So virtual environment is kind of a sandbox that you create just for the project that you'll be working on. And it won't spoil all your existing Python installation or the base installation that you have. So for example, if you choose existing interpreter and you go to the interpreter, uh, for example, you go to the system interpreter and you ch choose Python 3.7 or 2.7. So I have both installed on my machine. Um, so if you choose Python 2.7, so you will see a warning here, a note here that you need admin permissions and uh, consider creating a per project virtual environment instead. So which means that uh, if you choose this interpreter, then all the project files will be in this uh, location and any changes or any new packages that you install for this project will impact the base installation, which is basically the Python, uh, the base Python installation. If you choose 2.7 or 3.7, it will impact or it will impact the packages that are within this Python 2.7 or 3.7, whichever interpreter you choose. So it's highly recommended that you don't choose the system interpreter and use the virtual environment instead. So to do that, just cancel that and choose the first option. So new environment using, just select the virtual environment, which is which will basically create a sandbox for you using the base interpreter. So it will sort of create a copy for your project. So whatever project with the base interpreter, whichever you will choose. So I'll choose 3.7. Uh, just give the um, project name first. So I'll say RCV demo. And here you'll see the location users, my name, uh, PyCharm projects, RCV demo. And you can rename this virtual environment. So I'll say uh, RCV uh, demo v env. Okay, so that will be the name of the virtual environment where the new virtual environment will get created and your project will lie there. Now, if you want to inherit the global site packages, just check that box. Otherwise, you can just leave it unchecked. Or if you want to make um, available to all project this this virtual environment, then you check the second checkbox. Uh, as of now, what I'll do is I'll just keep them um, as default and just hit create. So once you hit create, it will start creating the virtual environment. And so it will it is it is creating the virtual environment. It will take some time and then it will open the project space. So now you can see welcome to PyCharm. Just close the tip. And now you can see that under PyCharm projects, RCV demo space has been created. Uh, and this virtual environment has all the details. It has the binaries and libraries uh, which have been copied from the base interpreter. So that's pretty much all about creating a project in Python in PyCharm. So thank you.